Hello and welcome to a new video from me, Koen. And today we're going to talk about the extruder and we're for going to uh, produce filament for the very first time. I designed a puller. Uh, last time I said it was going to be great. I will design a puller. It will be great. Uh, yeah, you can judge for yourself. It's, it's something. I designed my puller completely from scrap uh, in my dad's garage, which sort of works, which is quite amazing. So I really improvised and tried to be creative and, and, and this is what you get. So these small gears I've got out of a printer which was lying around and we didn't use anymore. And uh, I've used these trolley wheels to pull the plastic out. So the idea is uh, the plastic when it comes out of the extruder, it pulls with these two wheels so we can control the thickness uh, of the filament which is coming out. So we can increase the speed, so we have thinner filament. And so I can also sort of try and make filament from three millimeter to 1.75. And it works! Yay! Look at that. Hear the beautiful sound of a very precisely made scrap metal machine. You know, you don't buy this in the shop. You you, you don't. So, after some small technical difficulties, we now have sort of working setup for the puller. As you can see, I just mounted it all on uh, the power supply of the BLDC motor. This is a 12 volt BLDC motor. Uh, I've used this one uh, because I needed to have a sort of powerful motor to sort of have the great torque to pull out the plastic and I'm controlling it with this BLDC motor controller. This is a great motor controller because it has the option of a PWM control, which is great when I want to uh, configure this uh, with a thickness sensor to control the thickness directly in a closed system. But for now, I'm using this small uh, pot meter to control the speed. If I turn it slightly around, it will start rotate. And now we play the waiting game and wait until the extruder is at least 200 degrees Celsius so we can start and put some plastic in it. Ooh. Now, uh, yeah, the extruder is finally surpassing the 200 degrees. Uh, let me first fill it up and then slowly start it and then we will see ABS coming out of it. Let me first start opening this. Uh, oh, uh, in a way I won't or anything. This is really not my skill. Really. I don't have scissors right now, but this sort of will work. Yeah, this 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 is this is great. This really works. And as you can see, smoke is coming out, which is um, very very interesting. So it's very important to really ventilate a room when you're doing this. Uh, because the ABS can have some fumes which are not quite nice to breathe in. And we're full. Yes. And we get plastic. Yay! Um, so last time I used black plastic and I tried to clean everything out of it. But it still has some color of the previous plastic in it. This is just the first few centimeters or meters. And it needs to go very slowly. So increasing this speed, putting this here. Well, sort of create the filaments. Oh, we need. Oh. No! We have quite a bit of plastic coming through it. And then we can slowly pull it out. And we want sort of this thickness. Because this is going to ah, pull.
So the speed control is still a bit of a problem. This is the back side. This is a small engineering problem I have. Oh, this is a very big engineering problem I have. I need a hammer. I need a hammer. So what I'm doing now is I'm sort of trying to fix this bit, which is sort of on the drill bit, which sort of got loose because the attachment wasn't that great, I'm afraid. So after a few trial and errors, um, we're going to test if we can pull it out and contain a sort of constant thickness of the filament. And there's the beautiful sound of my pulling machine. So, oh. Ah. Put your hands within the wheels, very, very safe. So. Oh, crap. Ah. This thing is helemaal goed. This isn't my favorite test run ever. Right, take 25. All right. Ah uh, man, okay. So, I need to redesign the puller. And I need to redesign other things. It's very clear that this construction doesn't work. Anyway, um, as you can see, the extruder works. We made a lot of plastic. Uh, this is a piece of shit and I need to replace it. I need to make it completely new because I tried and tried and tried, but it's garbage and I want to destroy it. Um, in a fire, we made this filament, um, which, well, you can't 3D print with it. Problem was the puller. I thought it would work, it didn't. Too bad. So thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and leave me a comment and see you in the next video.